What's up, guys? Hi, my babies. Let me. I'm not gonna give it out, but I'm emailing Andrea Marini right now. I mean, I'm right in the middle of it. If you can see, yes, I am. I emailed last night a friend of mine's, and I asked his friend of mine's that he's like really really how can I just say this he's big time but I asked him to do me a favor and to find out um a couple of things for me and he said that he would have them and that he would have them for me when I asked the questions that I asked him to to you know to ask and he said he would have the answers for me so, I'm happy about that. But I'm emailing him, and as you can see, it says, Hello again! And it's just going to say the same thing. Did you help recreate? And now, this time, I'm going to put a picture of him in the hotel. And we're going to see what he says when he sees himself on camera, and he sees the other guy with the camera, and he already knows that I know, and that Susie knows, he knows that. He knows that anybody, the only people that know what really happened were me and Susie because we've been knowing about Andre Marini and Joey Sags from the beginning. And when I try to tell you guys, y'all guys didn't listen. So what we're gonna do is not take this as a joke anymore. You guys gotta stop trying to prove how Kanika walked through the kitchen. Prove who was in the kitchen. We know this already. We know it, guys. We know it. Why? I mean, why? Why keep proving how do you separate them? We know it was a setup. We know they set her up to get raped. We know they set her up to die. We know they set her up for a bunch of shit. We know who was involved. But ain't nobody going to do nothing about that. But at least we can at least confront the man, the two men that were, and Judy, that were responsible for what happened on the 9th, not on the 6th. On the 6th, Kanika attended a party with Irene Monifa and Wesley Snipes looking bitch. Mm. I swear, that's what she looked like. My cigarette turned off. I'm sorry, guys. Anyway, I'm not no longer going to stop proving how we pull them apart. How We know how. I done told you who is behind this, and nobody want to listen to me. Does it take me to actually... Bring them out into the open so you guys can understand that this was all a set. Andrea, Marini, Joey, come out and say it already. It's already done with. Saw the pictures that I put in yesterday in the video. You saw how they were able to set off the cameras. Like I told you, that hotel doesn't have cameras. They don't. The cameras that were put up were the cameras that were put up by those two and their crew. And the crew consisted of Kanika's friends. And the other guys that held the cameras. Did you see how that picture that we put in at the end of the video, how the police had his hand, just like Kanika, looked inside that room, just like Kanika, and... Didn't it look just like Kanika's pose? The cop and Kanika? If not, look at my last video. The cop and Kanika. The same position. Walking in the hotel. Look at it, guys. Oh, what you guys gonna do? Keep trying to prove them and separate them and, and keep asking questions. No, the questions you need to ask now is why was this done? Who was to benefit from this? 
Why was it done like this? And then maybe we can get some answers. Because keep putting them apart, keep showing that Irene was involved, Monifa was involved. We know this, guys. We know it, we know it, we know it. I will no longer keep pulling them apart. I will no longer show how they did this and show how they did this. I know how they did it. Look what happened on the 6th. They recreated it on the 9th. How do I have to tell you people this? I'm no longer going to go ahead and try to prove the past. I'm too much into the future now. I know who's behind this. I mean, by now, of me telling you guys it's a set for almost three years, I thought that you guys understood that I meant it was a set set. That what happened on the 6th, they went ahead... Juicy fruit. They went ahead and they recreated everything, but they forgot the ticket, the parking ticket. And these are masterminds, and these masterminds failed in one thing, in that ticket. That ticket is all proof to what happened, plus her soul that keeps talking and talking and talking. And they say, oh no. That's not what I'm hearing on Candace Starr's um, page. Yeah, I am hearing it on Candace Starr's page. I hear it clearly. Without a machine, I can hear it. Without putting my speakers on and, and getting in a room, because I got big speakers. I no longer have to do that. I've heard enough. She said it with her own mouth, her own soul. Lock them off, both of them. She meant her mother and, and B M Teresa and Leonora, guys. If you want to prove something, prove who did it now. Not We know who did it at on the 6th. Prove who recreated it on the 9th. I done throw you guys a bone. I showed you. Me and Susie done showed you them. Picking up the camera um, um, wires. Pulling off. The, uh, uh, putting them off the red boxes so they can go off. Going right under them so they can go off. What do you think he was doing when he was pulling that in the last video when he was pulling the wires? He was making the box go off. And those, that hotel doesn't have any cameras on any floors. There's not one camera on the floor. There's only a camera in the upper kitchen level near where the shelf is at. And that camera was also put there by no other than Marini. And Senor Marini. He put him there. That hotel doesn't have cameras. I don't know how to tell you guys this. It doesn't have cameras. Now, I love you guys, but I need you guys to stay woke. Because if you don't, you're going to keep staying in the past and trying to prove what happened to this child. We know what happened. We know who was involved. We know she was thrown to the pool and she didn't know how to swim. Guys, stay woke, bro. What's up? If we were able to prove, everybody was able to prove how Kanika wasn't even in the picture at the time, what makes you think we're not able to prove who pulled this off? Unless you're calling yourselves dumb. Because I've done gave, me and Susie done gave you guys a bone and showed you. We done showed you who's behind this. I mean, what else? What else you want? Because, I mean, 
wake up. And it's time to stay woke. And it's time to stop with the past and get into the future. I'm about to put a clip in with Susie talking, guys. And, um, Pitta's so cute. She got bear ears on. She's so cute. Um, and then we have some pictures for you. We have a picture for you. And I got it from, um, Cynthia Starr, and I got it from Susie. Susie had it. And it's a picture of Irene, dressed like Kanika. I want you guys to see this. It's disgusting. She's disgusting for doing that. Hi guys, this is just a quick video I've done of this image of Irene. She's dressed as Kanika. She's, um, her hand is approaching um, a panel like a door and I flipped it around so you can see many faces that's in this one image. Sometimes I see it's like Kanika trying to get out of the freezer and she's struggling. I can see um, other people's faces in this video. See what you think. I'm going to do an extended version where I'm going to show what I see in um, this video. Thank you. If you take a look at the next few pictures, at the top, it looks like some workers were trying to lift her out. Let me know what you think, guys. Are they helping her climb up a wall? It looks like she's outside somewhere. Or they've managed to open up the uh, freezer or room she was in. <laughs> 